Hey, so I'm going to go through my GoPro Hero 8 settings for when I fly FPV. Um, there's basically two settings I shoot in. I either shoot in 4K, 4x3, 30 frames per second, or I shoot in 4K, 16x9, 60 frames per second. Um, 4K, 4x3 is going to get you the most resolution. Um, but you can only shoot up to 30 frames per second in this, so if I want to go slow-mo, I have to go to 4K 16x9, and then we can go up to 60. Next setting I choose is lens. I always go to wide. Um, hyper smooth is off. I stabilize my footage in real steady um, afterwards, so it needs to be off for real steady to work. If you don't want to use Real Steady, I would recommend putting Hypersmooth on. Turn on ProTune. Make sure your bitrate is set to high. This is just going to give you the best quality footage. My shutter is set to 1 60th because I'm in 4K 30. If I were to go into 4K 60, I would change it to 4, uh, 1 1 20th. Um, and as you see, I do have ND on the front. So I use these to uh, get my exposure right so I can have my shutter at the proper shutter speed for what frame rate I'm filming. You want to have your shutter speed double what your frame rate is. So if I'm filming 4K 30, I want my shutter speed to be 1 60th. If I'm filming 4K 60, I want my shutter speed to be 120. So we're still in 60, so we'll keep this at 1, uh, we're still in 30, so I'll keep this at 1 60th for now. Uh, white balance for outside, I use 5500. If it was at night and I was inside a parking garage, for instance, I would use 3200. Um, minimum ISO 100, ISO max 800, so we don't get that green. I put my sharpness on low. Um, Color is always flat, so you can have the most flexibility in post to color grade. Um, I keep the raw audio on low just so I have that for archive. And then, yeah, that's about it. Everything else is kind of irrelevant. Um, but yeah, big things here are, um, if you're using Real Steady, shoot in 4K 30 or 4K 60. Uh, Real Steady doesn't support frame rates like 24 yet. Make sure that you're in the right frame rate. I've shot a lot of footage before and then not been able to use Real Steady because I was in 24 frames a second. But yeah, so that's pretty much it. I wanted this to be short and just get you guys the settings that I use.